All right, we are back here with the fantasy draft. Well, a different fantasy draft. We're not doing the same one every time, but this time around, we're going to be drafting from teams in alphabetical order. So we will start with Anaheim, work our way down, and that's how we're going to be doing it. So, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and randomize the team here as we do, and we get, boom, LA Kings. All right, let's do it. Fantasy draft on. Don't even think about it, Jabroni. Fog of War is not for me. Yeah, okay, looks good. Now, obviously, you know, if we're picking from every team, there's now 32 teams. Yes, I will do Seattle as well. Uh, and on top of that, there is 20 spots on a team. So there is going to be quick maths, 12 players that don't make the roster. So it's just, it is what it is. But yeah, I'm assuming most likely it'll be the bottom 12 teams. You know what I'm saying? But maybe not. So we got the 12th pick and my immediate go-to is going to be Gibson. 6.4, 90 overall. Yeah, absolutely. The two people that come to mind are Clayton Keller and Phil Kessel. So I'm not even sure what overall they are. Yeah, because OEL is no longer there. So I guess we're going to have to try and find Clayton Keller or <laughs> Phil Kessel, whichever one comes up first. All right, I might have passed Phil Kessel. I don't know. I'm not fully sure, but I came across Clayton Keller here. So let's go ahead and He's on an eight-year deal? Wow, I did not know that. So for Boston, obviously it would have been nice to get, you know, Bergeron, Pasta, or Marchand, but that's not going to happen. So we're going to get Taylor Hall, 87. And yeah, it's a not bad contract. I mean, it's not, not the contract he's currently on, but... All right, from Buffalo, we can't even... Reinhardt's no longer there, but we can take Olafson. So yeah, that's going to be our pick. Well, Giordano would have been ideal, but no. He got taken by a... Peculiar team that we will be taking from later on. So, yeah, we will be taking Rasmus Anderson instead. Okay, we actually have no centers, um, and we are on Carolina, so Jordan Stull is going to be a super duper pickup. Chicago's really been stacking up. Like, they're, I feel like they're gonna be a very good team this year. All right, uh, we're gonna take Jake McCabe here for Chicago. Let's go ahead and take Eric Johnson. As our Colorado pick. There's a super decent chance that I missed somebody else. But um, yeah, this is the <laughs> first player that I came across. So we're going to take Gavrikov. From the Dallas Stars. Believe it or not. Yeah. I'm going to take Braden Holpe. Really not fully sure how to pronounce this guy's name. Is it Osterly? I, anyway. I'm sure someone will let me know. Yeah, let's um, take that as our pick from Detroit. I think I'm honestly just going to take Mike Smith as a third string goalie because yeah, we're going to have a lot of players that aren't in anyway. So there we go. Oh, Florida Panthers. I don't care if there's someone better, which there probably is. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Drafting from our own team here, as you know, we did get the LA Kings. Let's take Dustin Brown. I mean, yeah, his cap is quite a bit, but whatever. We still sort of need centers. So yeah, I'll take Bjugstad, but I'm also noticing that our right wing category is lacking. And I think I might just know the guy to take from Montreal for that. I mean, they're not high overall or anything, but you all are Mia. Guy's sick. Colton Sissons. I don't know if it's, it could be Sissons, could be Seasons. Really could be either or. But either way, um, yeah, let's go ahead and take another right winger here. And that balances out our forwards. I have no idea why there is two... Um, is it the same player? Yeah, that's weird. I literally can't find a Tampa, or Tampa, New Jersey player. This is ridiculous. Finally, holy crap, Christian Yaros, there we go. <laughs> Get that team out of here. I'm pretty much just taking the first person I see <laughs> at this point because, well, yeah, I, I don't really have room to be picky. But anyway, Scott Mayfield, welcome aboard. Once again, I think there's like a duplicate and I have no... Why? Ryan Reeves from the Rangers. There we go. Apparently Del so I can't even. I Man, I'm not doing this the other way. This is a nightmare. Yeah, this is what it's come to. I'm sorting alphabetically now and just trying to find a player pretty much by going to names that I think wouldn't have been drafted yet. So Morin, welcome to the team. I'm looking at their roster and I see a name I've seen a few times. So I swear if they are not here, Thank you, Brock McGinn. Okay, there's our Pittsburgh player. Apparently, Nick Benino is on the Sharks. I had no idea, but yeah, there we go. Susie from the Kraken. There it is. Kyle Clifford. Boom. From the Blues. There we go. I'm so happy he was there. If he's gone, I'm going to be very upset because he has been here for a long time and no one's taking him. Where are you, Patty Maroon? You got to still be here. There's no way. Yeah, I was going to be pissed. 
if someone finally took him. Is the Wayne train still here? Yes, let's go. Fire me up. I have a lot of defensemen, but I knew that Brad Hunt would be here. So yeah, Vancouver, there's your pick. Good old William Carrier. There we go. There's our Golden Knights pick. Garnett Hathaway, Washington Capitals, or should I say Washington Crapitals? Either way, boom. Apparently Riley Nash is on the Jets now. So there we go. And that will do it. Wow. That was, that was a lot. I wish there was a way to search in this, you know? Instead of having to sort by alphabetical and stuff. So let me search. There's the team. I will have you know that I used the official NHL website roster. So if anything's wrong here, tell them to update their website. Not my problem. Like really EA Sports? I do best lines and you give me like... <sighs> I, I do not understand. I really don't get it. There's... Mm-mm. What's going on? For some reason they had the Wayne train in the minors, which is an absolute no-no, first of all. So, um, here we go. Great. Those are the best lines you can give me, EA Sports, huh? All right, well, whatever. I adjusted a little bit. We're just going to run with it. There's the defense. And if you want to have a look at the goalies, we got Gibson and Holpe. So, I this team does not look very good, I'm going to be honest, at all. Um, but who knows? We'll see. Ooh, a 10-2 loss to Calgary. That's not stuff that you love to see. Mm -mm. The team's kind of surprisingly turning it around here. Oh, Vetchkin's on the block. Okay, from Columbus, I see you. Yeah, just a quick look at the trade deadline availabilities this time. If this team makes the playoffs, I'm actually going to be pretty surprised. I did not see that coming at all. In fact, I didn't even make any predictions. I haven't looked at the points yet, so... I guess I'm going to say Taylor Hall has the most points with like 73. That'd be my guess. But I would have said... I don't know. My guess probably would have been like around this range so i'm not gonna guess obviously now it's way too late for that we have two games left but i probably would have been sort of in the right area i would have thought anyway because i didn't think we were gonna do very good didn't make the playoffs that's lame are you kidding me jumbo joe leading the team with 74 all right i see you so let's have a quick look at the standings here so we finished fourth in the pacific Let's look at the entire league. Who won the President's Trophy? Dallas with 111 points. So they did very well this year. And then, yeah, Jumbotron absolutely killed it this year. Taylor Hall had 72, so he was right there. And let's have a look at the goalies real quick. How would our attendees do? Not very good. Not very good. I'll be honest with you. All right, I expect a little bit better. 72 games out of Gibson, too. Why do he play so many? I guess he is a high overall, but still, holy crap. Uh, not what I wanted at all. I want the entire league. I saw the E, thought I was good, but I wasn't. Robin Lehner had an incredible season. Wow. Yeah, that's insane stats. I can't even believe that. How do you even manage that? What does their team look like? And then we got Austin Matthews with 102. Sagan, 99. Alright, so here are the top point getters for this season. We still have access to this feature right now, so I'm just going to look at San Jose's roster, and I can sort of see why they did very good. They have a ridiculous team here. Defense isn't phenomenal, but I could see it working. And then Kemper... Wait. No. It wasn't San Jose, was it? Am I insane? I think I'm insane. Okay, no. San Jose was our division. Sorry. San Jose won our division. Dallas won the league. So let's go have... Look at Dallas's roster. My bad. So they have... Oh. Okay. All right. Their top six is disgusting. And then their bottom six is like, you know, they can get the job done for sure. And then on defense, wow, they do have a very good team. And then obviously they had Laner. Yeah. All right. Understandable. Have a nice day. Dallas getting pushed to seven and the Blues knocked them out. Wow. All right. Well, that's a thing. And the Blues end up winning the cup. Look at that. All right. Good for them. And I'm guessing we can't do view lines anymore. Um, nope. We can go look at the stats, though, see what their team is made of. So, probably pretty good, I would imagine, considering they won the cup. Let's have a look here. St. Louis Blues, where are you at? There you are. All right, so they had Patty Kane, Radulov, Strom. Yeah, they have a pretty good team here, for sure. I could, I could see it, I suppose. I don't know if it's, like, crazy or anything, but... You know, I'm pretty sure there's like a helicopter flying over or something, and I have no idea why. But, um, you know, that's neither here nor there. So, what was I going to look at again? I had to look at something. What was it? Um, The awards? Yeah, the awards. Definitely got to look at that. So, St. Louis, Dallas, St. Louis, Montreal. Okay, and then we got Matthews with the Art Ross, Shifley with the Heart. The Norris goes to Hughes. Matthews with the Lady Bing. Calder to Lafreniere. Kane with the Consmythe. Leonard with the Vesna and the Jennings. Masterton goes to Forbert. 
We got um, Mark Hart <laughs> with the Jack Adams, O'Reilly with the Selkie. Ted Lindsay goes to Shifley. And we have ourselves a Tyler Sagan, Maurice Rocket Richard. So there's the playoff tree. Um, our team did okay. Uh, better than I thought we would. And I really thought we were making a push for the playoffs at the end there, but didn't quite make it. But it is what it is. So yeah. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And I will see you soon.